I'm Antonita Collins, joined by Redskins reporter John Keim. John, what do you attribute DJ Swearinger's success in Washington as opposed to his other stops in the NFL? Tony, I'm going to give you three reasons, and the <laughs> last one I think will surprise you a little bit. So first of all, he's back home at strong safety. It's a position he's always felt more comfortable at. Last year, he kind of went back and forth between free and strong because of injuries to the Redskins secondary. This year, Monte Nicholson healthy. They added Ha Ha Clinton Dix. Swearinger more in the box feels better. Two, film study. The guy's always been a guy. He's always been someone who likes to watch a lot of film, and you can see it paying off in some of his interceptions this year. He has four this year, two, one of which was against the New York Giants in the red zone, specifically came off film study. Notice a concept they like to run in the red zone. Faked Eli Manning into a certain throw. He was there to pick it off. And here comes a surprise at number three. He's a vegan. The last couple years, he was a pescatarian. This year, he turned vegan. And what Swearinger told me recently is that he feels like it's helped him recover faster after games. He also said his mind feels more clear. Now, that could be because he's more comfortable in the defense. For him, he attributes it to his diet. He said there's no uh moments out there. He sees it. He reacts it. He plays fast. You add it up, and it's why Swearinger told me recently he's the best safety in the league. Yeah, that last one was a total curveball right there, and he also made it clear he can't wait to face Houston. His former team Sunday will mark his second career meeting against them. That's John Kime with the very latest. Thank you, John.